guys. So I wanted to show you a trick to help you convert distance from kilometers into miles. For those of us living in the United States, um, this is not how fast you're going, it's not speed, it's distance. Uh, so if you ever were in a different country um, and somebody said you needed to walk uh, 60 kilometers to get somewhere, how many miles is that? And I'm going to teach you a way to do this without a calculator. It does take a little practice, but the results are um, usually pretty spot on, give or take, you know, a tenth of a mile or something. So we know that one kilometer is 0.6 miles. So it's just more than half. So what I do is I will look at the mileage of, on the kilometer, and this one it's one. I will take the number um, and find 10% of that number, and I will discover 50% of that number. So that would make it 6%. We read one, but right, I mean, it would be 60, but we're going to say 6%. So if you wanted to know how much a kilometer was, you would multiply that by 0.6 or 0.60, right? Um, and it would give you that amount. So how can you do this in your head? So the first thing we're going to do is figure out what is 10% of 100. And 10% of 100 is 10. And now 50%. So what is 50% of the total, of the total? Don't, don't mess with this number yet. We're going to do the total. So half of 100 is 50. 50 plus 10 is 60 miles. So 100 kilometers is 60 miles. One kilometer is 0.6 miles. Let's do that again. So we're going to walk a distance of 60 kilometers to get home because our car broke down. 10%. 10% of 60 is 6. 50% is 30. 30 plus 6 is 36. So 60 kilometers is 36 miles. So you get it? After a while you can do it in your head, especially if you've got these nice round numbers. Um, you can always pull out a calculator to check it, but figure out what 10% of the total is and figure out half the total or half of that number. Add those two together and you'll come up with the mileage. Works. It takes a little practice. Take some time and practice it. So if you're needing to walk in another country other than the United States and then, you know, the whole rest of the world pretty much uses the metric system. So we, as responsible people that travel to other countries, need to know how to convert numbers. So presto changer, that's how you do it. Um, let me know if you have any questions. I have a couple other mathematical tricks I'll throw at you to figure out some other um, things. So anyway, that's it for now. Let me know if you have any questions.